10 Calm Dog Breeds Number 1, Bichon Frise The small size Bichon Frise is playful and spirited, this breed was developed to be a companion first and foremost, so Bichon wants nothing more than to be with its favorite human. The Bichon is non-shedding, friendly, and well-behaved and will happily accompany you on daily walks to the park, chill on the outdoor patio of a dog-friendly restaurant, or simply hang out at home. Number 2. Cavalier King Charles Spaniel The Cavalier King Charles Spaniel is known for its sweet and loving temperament. The Cavalier is very playful and affectionate and calm in the house. Even though this toy-sized Spaniel doesn't need huge amounts of exercise, they should get at least two walks a day. Part of the American Kennel Club toy group, the Cavalier's most important job is being a loyal family companion. Number 3. Pekingese The Pekingese was a prized lap dog of Chinese royalty in the imperial court many centuries ago. If allowed to grow to its natural length, their flowing coat touches the ground, hiding the dog's short legs. Peaks doesn't need lots of exercise, and in fact, certain activities like swimming are off-limits due to their build. Pekingese owners must take care to avoid back injuries or overheating in warm weather. During warmer seasons, take walks in the early morning and evening hours for cooler temperatures. Peak aren't known for loving the company of young children, so this breed may not be the best choice for families number 4. Tibetan Spaniel The Tibetan Spaniel is not a true Spaniel but is more closely related to Pekingese, Lhasa Apso, and Pug. Tibbies, as they are affectionately known, were originally used as watchdogs in Tibetan monasteries. Lively and curious, the small Tibetan Spaniel is relaxed at home and happy to explore with you on walks. Still excellent watchdogs, this small breed enjoys sitting on windowsills or the backs of couches and surveying the homestead. Number 5. Whippet The Whippet is a medium-sized sighthound, which is a type of breed that hunts by using speed and sight. Although the Whippet is fast, it prefers brief sprints with plenty of relaxing time in between. Ideally, let your Whippet run off leash daily in a safely enclosed area so they don't run off. This breed has a short, smooth coat that's easy to groom. They're attached to their special people but may be aloof with strangers. Number 6. Clumber Spaniel Of all the Spaniel breeds, the Clumber Spaniel is both the largest and one of the most laid back. The Clumber is a flushing Spaniel, which means it, flushes, scares birds from their hiding places so they can be dispatched by the hunter. Though the Clumber has the stamina to hunt all day in the field, this breed is a calm and relaxed companion at home. Daily walks and hikes will fulfill their exercise needs. Clumbers do shed and drool quite a bit, so they aren't the best breed for a fastidious owner. Number 7. Basset Hound The Basset Hound is low to the ground, with very short legs and a long back. The breed was originally developed to hunt rabbits and deer. Packs of Basset Hounds would sniff out and track the prey, leading the hunters to it. Though solidly built and heavy set, the Basset Hound moves slowly and gets sufficient exercise from daily walks. Calm and loyal, the Basset Hound is a friendly and entertaining companion, though owners must learn to live with hair and drool everywhere. Number 8. Greyhound Like its cousin the Whippet, the Greyhound is a sighthound that hunts using its excellent eyesight and swift speed. In fact, the Greyhound is the fastest dog breed in the world. The record was set by a Greyhound who ran 67 miles per hour. If Greyhounds get daily opportunities to chase and sprint in a safely fenced space, they may be couch potatoes the rest of the time. The Sleek. Short coat is wash and wear, making the Greyhound an exceptionally easy dog to care for. Number 9. Newfoundland weighing in at 100 to 150 pounds, the Newfoundland is giant but has a mellow temperament, and their exercise needs are minimal beyond daily walks. This working breed was developed to assist fishermen in Canada, where they worked on ships, hauling fishing nets and rescuing swimmers in trouble. The Newfoundland is renowned for its gentle temperament and calm personality, something that makes it an excellent family dog. The Newfie sheds and drools a lot, something that might not appeal to everyone. Number 10. Great Pyrenees The Great Pyrenees is another giant breed that needs less exercise than you might think. This livestock guardian was originally used to watch over sheep, something the breed is still used for today. Though calm, the Great Pyrenees is always watchful and ever vigilant to potential threats which could also translate to excessive barking. This breed does well with a couple of walks a day. The thick, white coat sheds a great deal, and the breed is also known to drool, so it might not be the best breed for someone who likes a clean house, and extra care is needed in hot climates.